see this question from differential equation so when seeing the question the first uh, thing is always to go for the variable separable if possible so um, for that uh, just let's uh, let it go to the rhs so y into under root 1 plus x square dy equals to minus x into under root 1 plus y square dx now this is fine this is also fine so bring this under root 1 plus y square to the lhs and this under root 1 plus x square send it to rhs so y divided by under root 1 plus y square dy is minus x divided by under root 1 plus x square dx fine now integrate both side as usual integrate both sides so you will get integral of y divided by under root 1 plus y square dy is minus integral of x divided by under root 1 plus x square dx. Uh, for this integral if I let under root 1 plus y square uh, or rather uh, let 1 plus y square as t square. Differentiate both sides. So 2y dy equals to 2t dt. So you are getting y dy equals to t dt. Okay. Your integral will convert to t dt divided by uh, under root of t square is t only. That's why I took uh, 1 plus y square as t square. Now for this let uh, 1 plus x square as u square. So 2x dx will be 2u du, 2 to gets cancelled, x dx is u du. So your integral converts to minus of integral of x dx is u du divided by under root u squared is u only. So first you are getting integral of dt which is uh, uh, integral of dt is t and what was your t? Under root of this thing. So under root of 1 plus y square from this integral minus equals to because equals to was there minus sign was there this integral you will getting u uh, with a minus sign minus sign I have already written so uh, minus of what was the u which was under root 1 plus x square so minus sign I have already written this integral is giving me under root 1 plus x square plus a constant c so I just uh, solve these two integrals separately and then I uh, just uh, written it here. Now we can take this term to the LHS. So under root 1 plus y square plus under root 1 plus x square equals to c. This is your final answer. So again an easy one as far as variable separable differential equations are concerned. Just take similar terms, variable terms to one side, integrate and get to the answer.